Hello everyone and welcome to my new let's play. It is Wheel and Stitch for the PS1. It's the 20th anniversary of this game this year. So I thought this would be a perfect time to start this game. So yeah, you start off here and in Wheel's room and um we get to do a rest, but I won't mess around with this. Right now and sounds and yeah, there's sorts of uh, Oh, I just changed music just by selecting that. What's of like Elvis songs that um because the big fans of Elvis in the movie, so yeah. Um So yeah, actually I did a survival of this game um on my channel a while back, but I'll we'll, we'll go we'll check this back another time, but uh, yeah, I guess we'll just start a new game right now. So yeah, hopefully this is going to be a fun let's play to do, and oh, I think I'm going to have to sadly skip the movie cutscenes. Um, even though, like, I, I don't really know if it would be that bad, like, I know we was all, like, scared of that back in the day, um, years ago, of playing movies, clips, but yeah. Uh -oh. There you are. Listen, Lilo, I've got to go to work now, so I'll meet you in town at one o'clock, okay? Okay! One o'clock. That's ages away. Come on, Stitch. We can get some more photos for my wall. Oh, right. So, yeah, we've got to collect 16 photographs first. So, um, um yeah, I can't believe I'm actually doing this again. Yeah, I don't think I'll save, but yeah cars here right now. You get to explore around the place and you can go up here but what's of just invisible walls you can't go much further than that. But yeah we get to play as Will we we right now and yes they're just here but yeah I guess we'll go into the first level so yeah let's go through here and it's Koa Wood if that's how you say it. Uh, if that's how you pronounce it but yeah I'm First of all, you play as Wheelo um, in the full game, and although in the demo of the game you play as Stitch in this level, and actually that's an interesting thing, but yeah, I guess this is the start of the part. This is the thumbnail, uh, since it's the very first um, start and uh, level, so here we go with that. So yeah, I can't believe I'm doing this, and yeah, I'm once again, this game. Oh, wait, that went weird there, wait, the light. Wait, what? It turned colour. It got darker, the, the barrel. Um, but yeah, this this game, you know, it's it's like this. It's uh, linear. Uh, yeah, people um, like to compare it to Crash Bandicoot. It, it does feel like that a lot of the time. Um, and there are chase levels and stuff. So, um, yeah, let's pick this up. It's telling us to pick it up. So, yeah, first of all, the tutorial. Um, got tutorial stuff. And yes, it's got that plant enemy. Um, but yeah, this is really interesting. This could be the shortest let's play I've ever done because because these levels are actually short and there's only 15 levels in the whole game. So this very this very well maybe my final um not my final ha <laughs> no um that, 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 that will scare people if I say this is my final game though. No. It's not don't worry I've still got lots of other games to do. I want to do still I'm still playing with him. Oh god. He got me, no, you idiot. But yeah, I got a correct a hundred correct balls in every level and you know it's a rest and wait, maybe you should mess around with him. Oh he tries to get you like that and oh but he's a cute little thing, so oh, I don't wanna get him because the eye is cute. <laughs> you know just how quickly my spirit here is hey, oh, let's play. I've been saying uh the you know the father is so realistic in that game, so it's like really cute. Oh, that's a weird thing, when the music restarts in this game, just, um, it, like, stops you, it, like, it's, um, it's an effect in the game as well. When the music replays, it, like, it makes you, like, um, freeze for, like, a second or a split second or something. You might notice that, but, yeah, actually, really do love this game. Like, I played the demo first as a kid. Oh, this is a weird bit here. They put all those three in a row and then they put a picture by side for enemy and you can just get around them. 
but yeah, do of you know how a game works and it, it can play alright, but it can get like annoying sometimes. <laughs> it's um, but yeah, I, I'd say uh, your controllers uh, yeah still hold up, you know, okay. But yeah, um, a lot of games just really loved copying Crash a lot. Um, but this this feels like it's its own sort of thing, really. Like we're not getting boxes; we're just having to get hundred quick balls in every level. And um, yeah, um, so I first played this game on <coughs> Euro Demo ninety. Um, that was like my second ever demo disc. That like yeah, my my family got. And this game was on it, it was like the featured game, and yes, there we go, I think, got everything, and you've got these tiki statues around in the level, and yeah, it goes along well with the movie, so yeah, it's really interesting, we don't really get, like, Disney games coming out with when the Disney movie comes out anymore, like, that used to be, you know, the, the main theme, you know, back in the day, like, we would get a movie, I mean, you know, and you get the game with it, and it's like, oh, we don't really get that anymore, do we? Um, but yeah, we, we already made it past the first level, so yeah, because of because of um, well, to get stuck there, like with um, with um, invisible walls and stuff. Um, but yeah, can't go through here yet. But yeah, might as well check the place out a bit and got plants here, and um, yeah, now this is the first boss. And this was in the demo as well, the what you play as um play this part. And yeah. What's actually interesting about that demo is that it actually I found out on the cutting room floor um checking out this game. Like the demo level is actually in this game, but I, I tried like the other day and I can't figure out how you like hack into it, but the demo level where you play a stitch in Corvod is actually in this. You know, it's actually in the full game. Um, you can play a stitch, but like you have to have like a specific code and like put it in Game Shark. Um, but yeah, there's a picture of a car on the sign, there, and now this is level two. And yes, I'm gonna go straight into it. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna do five levels per part, and there'll only be three parts. So yeah, because otherwise, yeah, if I. Now I'm playing a stitch, um, you can spin and stuff and do spit, but yeah. Uh, um, yeah. It, because these holes are so short, you know, I thought I might as well do the let's play that way and rather than tracking it out and like only doing a part a week, but you can look at stuff here, but you can't really go much. I mean, this, this hole feels a bit more open, there's a bit more open space, you gotta go. So I decided, and I always thought it was cool that there was a car here and you jump on it. But yeah, if you go near the lady, then she tries to whack you with the with the broom stick. So, um, but this is funny. There are boxes in this level, so oh, I think this is a sneaky coffee cup. So yeah, with Stitch, you you know, he collects coffee cups, and he has a meter. Um, and I don't think in like um. I don't think that was the original plan, actually, for Stitch, because um, I've seen some screenshots and I'm, you know, I'm always interested in prototype things for this game, and, um, yeah, in early screenshots he didn't even have a meter and he collected, like, regular quick balls. But, like, yeah, I actually have uploaded prototype footage of this game on my channel before, um, and, like, he collected, like, uh, coffee bottle was actually in that, and I always thought it was like cigarettes, but then you realise that it even says online um, that yeah, for some reason it, they just talked like cigarettes, and I thought it was very dark, but no, it actually turns out it was never cigarettes, so I don't, don't have to worry. Um, but it did look like that in, the, in like the weird prototype for a dress game I uploaded, and I found online and. Yeah, because it was on your demo 89, that that footage. Um, I put it, like, yeah, over two years ago, nearly three, you know, because it was in 2020, but, yeah, 
with that waterfall dam and oh yes, could still crack that coffee cup and give yeah, us always fun. You can ride this wooden platform rock thing and oh no, yeah, was it that now? Yes, we have four meters, so we can just um. It's running really fast, but you can actually turn into a ball and um, roll around, and you can even roll and bounce on the water, which is fun. Like, I don't know if they. I always thought that was like that was a glitch, but maybe the developers did intend that. You don't know, but guess not a picture. But yes, yeah, it's, it's just it's good enough that like right now we're we're running fast with with Stitch here. Um, so we don't really even have to use the meter, but yeah, before he was crawling once. I never really noticed this detail as, like, as like a kid playing this game, but yeah, here we got to do that first and then the shrimp, because if you destroy that first, then you can't even get the pitch anymore, so we've got to be careful with stuff like that in the game, but I think I know what I'm doing. This feels like the perfect place to use the roll, actually. So I like keep using that, and you can quit out of it, you don't have to... Use it all up. Um, but yeah, we've got these wargs here now, and they remind me of the ones from Tarzan. PS1 as well, and they try to run at you and get you. Oh, yeah, this is interesting. This this picture of Stitch on this, actually, I'll talk about it. Because that was the meter originally looked like this. So, like, his, um, his face on this, um, the picture of Stitch on. On those um, things, and this is weird, you can do this in the T poses, but you get stuck, but you can't fall over. But oh no, now we're through it. If you butt bounce it, we'll come through the, the thing now. That reminds me of like getting stuck in the thing in, um, in, in Sparrow 2, like where you like um, with the gulp skip in the on planes, where you, where you get stuck in the ball, and yeah, stuck in the ball now. So that's funny, but. At least that's good. You can't go out to the water, so we can't can't fall in the water there. But yeah, I guess I'll just run along here, getting all these. Um, yeah, these are the checkpoints, by the way. But yeah, it's been a long time since I've actually seen the movie. I remember going to cinemas back in 2002, um, just to actually see it, to see the movie, and yeah, it was a real good time. Like, I should. Um, actually see the movie again because it, it's been a while but yeah I remember as a kid I think we had like the DVD of the game and um like I like one day I was off sick from school and I just kept on watching it <laughs> repeatedly and like I don't know why I was just like really um obsessed with the movie I guess um like I just kept replaying it for some reason <laughs> just for fun and yeah um, so, at the time, like, I really um, had it, like, ingrained in my mind and in my head. So, I knew what was going to happen. Oh, I died! Oh, and I killed him at the same time after. Oh, my God. I don't think I was paying attention. No, I lost all my power up now. I lost all my meter. And, like, you don't get it back. It's gone. And, oh, you can get hit by a car, but <laughs> I wanted to show it anyway. But yeah, hedgehogs are annoying because they spike you like that. No, what the hell for that? I didn't think the cow was going to kill me. Wait, did I have all my health? Why did it insta-kill me? Oh, no. Okay, the problem is this game, well... Don't know, um... But, like, yeah. Um... <laughs> you can lose your lives. Like, you can get a lot of lives, but then, like, you can lose them all very fast. It feels so... Gotta be, um... Uh, more careful, but yeah, thank god this this game is not... We're not doing it survival this time, because I, I would have already failed it, because I've already died, like, twice in the survival, I think. So, you know, it's this place, which I don't even know how, like, how it's pronounced, so... Hawiakua? Hawiakua? Uh, I think, um, maybe. But, yeah, that's a funny story. Oh yeah, select is this, so... You can go back, you can select levels from here. But yeah, there really isn't that much to this game though, like, and the levels are short and linear, like that. But, like, as a kid, I never really thought too much about that. Oh, 
we we've made the camera angle weird here. Yeah, and I just thought of playing this game as a kid. I, I didn't really ever think about how short the game actually is. But nowadays, yeah. Because I think, you know, I just replay this game a lot just for fun. Because there was just something about it and, like, the look of the game and, like, all this, um, together. And Gilly already killed that rock, rock, rock monster there. Um, but yeah, the truck right here right now, it's like, got, um, wheat on it. Um, or hay, or whatever you want to call it. But, yeah, I think we are doing pretty good so far. And, right, you can just punch stuff here and get a pineapple is this way. But now, it's back to stitching. Oh, the music stopped. Oh, I and mean, then it just didn't come back. I guess it, it was because it was already loading. So, the game thought, oh, there's no point <laughs> reloading the music. That's weird. Um... I don't know what's that happened before. But yeah, no, it's this of all. Me a uh, trail or. I don't know. But it looks like there's um, watermelons on the floor there. Not, not watermelons, pineapples, goddammit. <sighs> um, yeah, I don't know why I sometimes accidentally call them up this time. Uh, um, sometimes. Um, but yeah, this looks like a nice uh, place as well. And oh, yeah, this music, like. It's. Um, so, like, familiar. I've, I feel like I've heard it before. Like, on, like, McDonald's toys. I've, like, Toy Story 2, like, I think the horse that, for some reason, I just remember that. Like, back in the day, um, but, yeah, like, this, 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 um, like, track. It must be, um, similar to something. Like, I guess I could borrow these up, actually, with... Doing that, I don't know if I even used the one in um, the first of all if we were the, the TNT barrel. Oh god! Yeah, I guess that's what they were going for. They they really wanted to do what crushed it with TNT, so they wanted TNTs. And yeah, I think I'll just pick it up. Oh, she just got it just in time. I think. Um. So yeah, wait. There's nothing on top of this. You gotta be careful with these because sometimes I think it's like an oil can. Um, okay, this this one's annoying because he does it three times, but yeah, just you have to get close to him, but yeah, I had the most trouble with these enemies as I killed these points and yes, got this. That's that's a power up, oh god. Well, I keep calling it power ups, but um special move, like, you know um weapon. Um oh yeah, you can do I think you can do the same thing here. Yeah, like, she's stuck in the gate, but it looks like a Barn or something like, like, um, yeah, like it looks like a horse stall. Um, looks like a horse would be, you know, looking out of it. <laughs> so, yeah, I've got me, got to make sure I'm getting all hundred collectibles because I, I do want to do that. Oh no, even though I like. It doesn't actually really matter, really, because I don't think... Oh no, I think you get stuff for the gallery, although... Like... Actually, no, isn't that just for the, like, the main collectibles, like, the pictures? Oh, very close to Maybe I'll save my... This for something else, so yeah, we can either do that or that right now. We can use the spoon power-up, or we can use the TNT barrel. So, um... It's actually funny, I think, as a kid, I, I, I got a like, plastic spoon and I I tried to recreate that spoon. I think that spoon is in the movie, though. Oh, no, 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 I killed myself oh, with TNT barrels. No. Oh, I, I still get to keep them. That's cool. No. It's got a really terrifying face. However, in prototype footage, um, you might notice some, um, yeah, like on the footage I uploaded to my channel, you can still find on my channel if you want to see it, but yeah, like the plant enemies look, they have like different faces and that, I, I think. But yeah, gotta get that bug down. That like dung beetle, I guess. You yeah, can just explore all these. Um, so this is weird to make you do that, and like there's one on it. No, don't want the picture. Oh god, well, at least it comes down far enough. 
got to be careful with this kind of stuff because I'm um, in the later levels, I think. Oh no, oof, I didn't need to do that, but I think the TNT would have got it anyway. Hedgehog, oh no, oof, I jumped at the same time. <laughs> That's very dangerous, I've got to be, I've got to calm myself down, I think. I think I'm, I might be rushing things a bit too much, but it's funny that the sound effects, it's kind of satisfying. Um, when like those, oh no, I fell in. But you get respawned right to the edge, and that's always a good thing. Um, give a satisfying sound effects when, like the oil cans break. Like you can hear it a bit, and it's like, oof. I mean, that was a massive explosion there, but yeah. So there's a hundred collectibles in each level. Like these ones always charging me, and he gives a ton. So that was always. So that's satisfying, like, to me. Um, oh, yeah, see, the music restarted, and then, like, yeah. Ah, oh, that, that's a sneaky one. It, it stopped me for a bit. Yeah, you got to be careful with these. you got to collect the feed on top first, then get the boxes, because if you don't, then you can't. If you do it the other way around, if you get the box first, then it's too late. Oh, let's just get him like that. Yep, use the guy with the ice cream and just squishes him. I don't know why. <laughs> it's, it's funny, but... Don't know why the developers thought of doing that, but you know, I guess they wanted Wheel to have like a special move as well for the game. But you know, Stitch just oh went past them a bit. Um, yeah, you can just roll around with Stitch with his power up meter, but because he drinks too much coffee and oh no, oh he got he's working on that bit. Uh, oh well, that's it. Like we're nearly towards the end here, and we've got all four out of our, um, I almost said presents, <laughs> photographs, um, just randomly hanging around in these holes, but yeah, 100 and, well, I'll just put it here, just to end the level off, and yeah, four out of four, and 100 pineapples, so, um, there we go, so that's the third level done, and yeah, now, heading to the surf shack. So like this is like kind of like a hub section, and then with it's just a small area, and then you know you've got a boss to the feet. Um, but yeah, cool. Save parts here, and right we can save, but like I I don't have a save spot. I don't have a memory card. Um, free space. So but there's no real point, like. Because I've checked and yeah, I actually played this game a bit, you know, uh, for myself the other day as well. And just checking things out, like I said about the demo. But I like it, so that's annoying. I would I would like to show that, but I can't figure out how to show the actual demo of all in this game. But yeah, we can always play the demo or you can see footage of the demo um, if you want. So on YouTube, but I, I haven't actually played the demo, have I? Maybe, maybe I will one day, who knows? But maybe, will I go demo this again? Or, yeah, I'm not sure, but, um, you know, it's Maui Beach. So, yes, yeah, so like, I would like to show up, but I, I don't know how to, uh, and I don't think anyone else has shown footage of that on YouTube, or I could be wrong, like, there might be someone who's done it. Oh, yeah, and Stitch has chicken valve. Oh, he went over the walk the, the tree ranch. That's that's funny. But yeah, like the, there is cool music to these levels. Um, so yeah, you can't pick up TNTs with Stitch. So um, yeah, I actually remember the level walking completely different in Prototype Bridge. Oh yeah, it says funny you can stand on top of these, but it looks very awkward. He's like standing on the tip of it, but doesn't make much sense. But I think if we if we spit at them like this, like it's like toxic breath or something. Like green breath or it's like he's sparrow in a way, he wants to be sparrow, but because you can just keep holding it down and it just keeps Yeah, doing it everywhere and um I think if you spit if you do it the explode right away. So you just want to touch them a little bit and then get away and then yeah. And cones and... Oh, yeah, actually, yeah, just form up. So, the 
good. Go to pieces so I get that. Yep, bouncing on. Um, get the four E's, I guess. So, uh, yeah, no, this is a. Oh no, I touched him. Oh, I touched him from behind and I died. What? Or was it the rock that killed me? I thought it was the lobster. Yeah, I got some like kind of beat channels here, and the hedgehog is still here. And yeah, there was a weird snake enemy that they removed. Like it wasn't these plants; instead, they replaced a weird, weird snake enemy that would do the same sort of thing as the plants. And so, yeah, they replaced some of the pun enemies that we see. Yeah, like the brown pun enemies. Um. Yeah, you go so on this bit for some reason, like, you can jump on it, but you go super slow. Always thought that was weird, but yeah, they replaced um, weird snake enemies in the prototype for a trip from yeah, the palm ones, and yeah, I, I was trying to say the, the brown ones only try to get you once, but then the green ones uh, are annoying because they like try to get you three times with their necks and they try to chomp you three times when and then they and then they stop. So the I I I think yeah. I have more um yeah it's more easier to get the the, the brown ones. Like and I think they're a bit purple so aren't they or yeah. So yeah what could we for Stitch? I don't think he ever Fights? You know, I don't think Stitch ever defeats that type of enemy, or wait, does he? Could be wrong. No, but I don't know if he defeats the green one, the green pump. But I remember, yeah, this level actually looked quite a bit different. Um, in the prototype for a jewel. I mean, oh, this is a good place to use the roll, because you can bounce around on the water, you don't even need to use. Uh, oh. He's getting a bit too excited, but let's do this anyway. Activate the platform and then get bounce around and yeah, look, we're bouncing on the water here. And this is so fun, you can just like skip a lot of that, so it's it's really useful. So they, they made, like, yeah, developers made that feel good, it feels like rewarding. Oh, yeah, that's his thing, that's that's the coffee bottle, that's what he originally created. I didn't, I forgot that. Yeah, that was the collectible. I should have remembered this. What the hell? Yeah, he was here. Yeah, he was yeah, drinking it from the baby bottle. Um, oh no, see, oh, I just I did what I said earlier. Oh, yes, still another movie clip in it. Um, no. Oh, we was right near a checkpoint, and we're back all the way here. Ah. Well, yeah, that's that's tough. That's how it goes sometimes. Um. If you get a bit too excited, oh. so yeah, these wooden platforms taking as long, but yeah, so it's good you don't have to collect everything in again, and you can use L1 to look at your inventory and you see how you're doing. Yeah, I mean, I, I do like that, that you don't have to collect everything again, though, like that would have been annoying, just get put back. But then now, now it feels like there's nothing to do for a while. Like we're just, we're just trying to get back where we were, and then quite some more stuff. But yeah, if this was, you know, crash, they would make you get all the boxes again. And so you might get them in a different way or something. So um, yeah, it's interesting. I, I can kind of see why, like, yeah, crash is more. Yeah, he's got a purple face a bit. Like even though you've, you're repeating what you did in Crash when you die and you get sent get you get sent back, like you do have to get the boxes again. But you can maybe try getting them in other fun, cool ways or something like that. But this is like, oh, you know, we died and we already corrected the stuff and we don't have to correct it again. So uh, it feels a bit, eh, you know, like it feels like, ah. Oh, we have nothing to do until we get back to the point we were at. And then, yeah. So I, I can kind of appreciate that for actually, you know, crash more. Because, well, yeah, you can actually climb these, but I just, like, simply jumped up it and it looks awkward the way he climbs. But this is one of the, uh, like, you, you only really climb 
a few times in the whole game, but you can climb it, but it's funny, you can just like jump it, I think. Like, can you jump it from here? Ah. So it looks. It looks really dark, though. Um. So, uh, Yeah. So. You yeah, like how the water looks here? Like, it looks like a nice evening place. I really love. Like, evening kind of levels. Yeah, I love how the sky looks in the evening. Like, like that of them. Yeah, this is actually not the only beach travel, like, there's another beach travel as well, so. Um, coming up. But, yeah, well, you can fall down here, but I don't think I want to, but. Yeah, just gotta make it over the bridge. Oh, yes, got full me here, so. Running along again. Oh, no, don't touch that. No, gotta get this first, because, ah, oh, smart move. Then explode it. But you don't, you don't even need to get anything out of them, so you can just explode them for fun, but. I guess I will, but you could just like avoid them. Whoa, I was. And actually, why did he stop? I was keeping on going it. I tried to. Um, yeah, this, this part is weird. Like, it's a ladder, but you, you can't even climb it at all. So, whoa, what the hell? This is weird. I'm going through it, man. Yeah, it's as if they wanted that to be a ladder there, I man. You know, they just didn't use it as a ladder. Um,. So that's really weird, and whoa. Yeah, I got these, these are the most annoying things about the level. Um, oh, well, I might as well roll around here, but oh no, oh, but these all fall down here. But yeah, final two coffee mugs, and yeah, that's that's the thing, like Stitch always gets coffee mugs. So yeah, I thought I'd go down there in the water a bit, bounce around. But yeah, that's it for Molly Beach, so there we go, 100 completed. For again, and yeah, that's that's it for the first forming levels. And yeah, now this is this is the boss. So we've got a defeat. Well, we got a beat Myrtle in a ray. So yeah, I always thought this was some um, funny as a kid. But yeah, sadly, I, I don't think I can just just to be safe. I'm just not gonna show the cutscenes. Oh yeah, I'll, I'll actually show what happens at first if you fail. So uh, you yeah, let's actually. Uh, Fail her first. It's funny to just have a picture icon in the top corner of her, like from the movie, like, like in that screenshot we just saw. But yeah, like, yeah, we'll, we'll show us a bit and oh no. Yeah, we'll let her win. But yeah, this, this music was always so funny to me as a kid. Um, so, yeah, it feels like perfect. Um, this race and it's like, oh no, you've got to, you've got to do it, you've got to win, but actually this music is used for another level later. I actually don't want to die, so, oh yeah, well, yeah, wait, so you actually die and lose life because she won the race. So, okay, now now we'll do it for you because that's what I wanted to try, but that's just kind of ridiculous how it happens. Oh no, she's, she gets more speed even though we're going at the same pace. But she's a little bit faster than us, oh no. But, well, actually, yeah, that makes sense because she's on a bike and bicycle and. Oh no, wait, it exploded. What the hell? They're exploding on impact. No, no, no. Oh. I don't know if that was a glitch. They. Or was it because she was there or. Yeah. That's weird. All those TNT barrels. <coughs> yeah. No, wait, what the hell? What? No! Wait, they're not meant to explode right away. What the hell? They're not even meant to do this. Something's glitched with the game? No! But that's not... No, 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 wait. Something's glitched about it. Um, that's not meant to happen. Um, they're meant to, like, rumble around. Um, why are they exploding right away? Because I think this is now a glitch. Um, they are not meant to do that. Is it because I died? I, I don't know what I did. Um, yeah, look at that. that you meant to stand on them and run across them and then... Yeah, that's not fair. No! What? what, what the... It's like it's on hard mode. No, it's now the race is impossible. I've never seen this happen. What? We're going to have to restart the path. First, yeah, we'll do that. Um, 
wow, I was not expecting that to happen. But yeah, let's uh, try it again. Yeah, just to restart because it, it must have been glitched for... Maybe I'll use directional pads because, yeah, using a lock. Yeah, this makes more sense because we're just going straight forward here, or like, you know, this way, you know, um, well, for her it would be straightforward, but it's like, you know, going uh, right. Just need to constantly be pressing right and holding it down, and then, oh yeah, see, now I fixed them, now they're just rumbling. Because if they didn't do that, then, wait, this would be impossible because you just die from them right away. I think we can make him explore them and, I think, oh no, damn it. She's catching up. I think, I think they affect her as well. But like, the, her ones, she's running to don't affect us. Oh, yes, we just made it and we, we just be here and yeah, now she's sad because she lost. So, phew, so yeah, we did it and well, yeah, just get a one second clip of, yeah, that's so celebrating that we won and stole her bicycle. Like, yeah, uh, so, you know, we've got another cutscene here, so, um... Hello there, Lilo. Oh, hello, Mr. Bubbles. So, what brings you into town by yourself? By myself? But I'm here with Stitch. Oh. Yeah, I'm teaching him how to be good. I see. Well, why don't you try leading by example and go home like a good girl? Mm, okay. That's it, Stitch. Lead by example. Elvis Presley is a model citizen. If you listen to his records, that might help you understand. Come on, we can play them at the hotel afterwards. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> but she's not really gonna go home. Like, she, so she tricked him, but... Yeah, but, you know, it says, uh... Like, yo, know, like a weird, um, yeah, face, and yeah, it's like an alien, and yeah, now this truck has gone. So, yeah, but yeah, we did all that, and so yeah, that's it for this first part of Will and Stitch. And this is the US version, by the way. Um, this is the NDSC version, and yeah, now, oh, that was cool drums though. This is like my favorite level in the whole game thing, this is my favorite music in the whole game. This is a very good track, and it's in the key track. In the key track, uh, yeah, could never pronounce it as a kid, I, I, I had no idea. Yeah, they're really difficult names to pronounce as a kid, these horse, but yeah, this was always a fun one. But yeah, I'm gonna leave it off here, and this is gonna be the next part. So, yeah, thanks so much for watching this first part. We were on Stitch, um, yeah, I was what I was gonna say was the PAL version is called We Were on Stitch Trouble in Paradise, but this this version. The American version is just called We Won Stitch, like, but that's it's funny, I don't think I ever knew that years ago, but yeah, but yeah, this is a good track, and yeah, can't wait to do more of We Won Stitch in the next part, and we'll do the next five rolls, and yeah, hopefully, have even more fun with this game, hope you're enjoying it so far, thanks so much for watching, I'm Spider Man Fun once again, and yeah, see you all in the next part for more, for part two of more of We Won Stitch, so see you all next time, goodbye for now.